Hi folks, this is Nancy. And today our obscurity level goes up since we are moving from Amiga to Acorn, <coughs> which is booting right now in emulator. Uh, so, um, back in 80s and 90s, Britain had its own IRM based desktop system. And this system, they run uh, RISC OS, these computers, and they were uh, based on IRM. The same IRM, which is in modern phones, like in iPhones, in Samsung, and like Android phones. And it is also now back on, uh, on desktops in Apple Silicon. So it made like a circle from desktop computers to uh, mobile devices and back to desktop computers because it is very good uh, architecture. And by the way, IRM architecture was uh, designed by a transgender woman, Sophie Wilson. <laughs> that is one piece of trivia for you. <clears throat> and by the way, another piece of trivia is that IRM uh, actually stands for Acorn Risk Machines. <laughs> that is uh, not like what they, uh, uh, the cipher with acronym now, but originally standard for these risk machines, which were separate computers competing with uh, MS-DOS, like IBM PCs with MS-DOS. And then later they made risk PCs that were competing with uh, Windows 90X uh, PCs, and they were run also, um, could run DOS because there was option to have x86 processor and additional IRM, but many top DOS games like Heroes of Might and Magic and Doom, they were had IRM ports for like um, RISC OS. But I think it is the early version of RISC OS I got here installed, but it already supports CD ROM, but not many CD ROM games. I think I can make like an image of all these games so you can run from CD-ROM if I like, but mm, I think I will have that for the later. Um, this uh, system is completely graphical, like, but it also has, I think, <coughs> it has uh, a non-graphical mode. Uh, I think I can exit this desktop and I have like command line and we have our usual uh, directory commands uh, like cat that lists current directory, I think. Uh, uh, X. Yeah, it is no drive in, uh, uh, I think, uh, uh, in basic uh, in, on a drive, but I think I can move to HDD. Uh, HDD, that is hard drive, and then I can to cut and list its contents, so I have some uh, applications, but I think these applications they need a uh, uh, graphical interface to run, so let's quickly put it back, desktop, yeah, we are back on desktop, <coughs> and so like that, it is like uh, Windows uh, 3 one but more advanced, like multitasking, so it is better Windows. Uh, than they were Windows, but unfortunately it lost competition to Windows because uh, they haven't captured that huge market share. They were only in Australia, Britain, like Ireland, and these like British uh, Commonwealth countries. So that is one nice piece of TV, but today we are playing a game. Uh, needless to say that Acorn has a few uh, nice but rather obscure games and one of these games is uh, uh, Dungeon, which we will be playing today. By the way, here is Spark of Us, which you will right, likely need to unpack uh, special <coughs> uh, high formats because in uh, here in uh, RISC OS files they don't have extension, instead they have uh, so meta information that can't be encoded probably in uh, usual Windows file names, but I think in DOS and uh, in Windows 9X there is some file name limitation size, so <coughs> you need special uh, SparkFS format that also has zip extension, but these files, they are not actually zip, they just 
<coughs> have zip extension for this uh, spark of us at can unpacked them which I use it to unpack with dungeon distribution. I was initially confused on oh, the zip form, but it is a corn risk OS zip format which preserves uh, extension of file type information, but <coughs> Uh, file type is not that important, as you see, this uh, exclamation sign prefix set uh, folders to actually, how do I say it here, um, application. So that was the first operating system which supported application, not just by executables, but uh, actual applications. I think I can enter it if I press shift and click. You can see that is inside of it, it is uh, information that is required to run this application, but uh, to uh, simple users like your mom and grandmother, like and children uh, who are not very good with computers, uh, if they don't know how to press shift uh, to click it, then they just run this application. I think uh, by default it uh, starts with run and it also has sprites or icons that in sprites it is uh, related to, uh, uh, to graphics, uh, how to display it. I think it has icon. That is also a very nice thing. <coughs> so let's run this dungeon game. Mm. It has music, and it also uses mod music, like in Amiga. But it has its own mod formats, obviously, because it has eight channels music. <coughs> I think that game it is kind of hidden jam because it is really nice looking, <coughs> and it also has some unique gameplay elements. So it is switch panel and it is blobber game like RPG game, but we control like four characters. But I think it is more kind of similar to Ultima Underworld, but with four characters, and there is a lot of going on. It's I think if we step on this panel, we get a door closet lock. And there's also this thing that we have to collect uh, these uh, torches. I think like in uh, this uh, death gate or whatever that it was adventure for a uh, uh, game, quest game. Uh, for any years on Apple computers where you have to use torches, otherwise it can be a bit darker if you remove these torches. Yeah, you see it will get really dark if you won't have a torch. So we need a few people with torches because if one of them dies, then we will be in completely dark. Uh, we are in lower confinement cells, so apparently it began with us getting thrown in prison, but I don't have a menu for this game. This, there are also several four levels, so it is like actually 3D game, I think, not like Doom. Uh, it has really nice texture mapping. We also can have this. Uh, candles, I think they can also serve as uh, light sources, but like lesser of light sources on this. But we can kind of see walls, so it is not like completely dark. Yeah, we can also use candles instead of. <laughs> this uh, torches and we can use several candles like and then we all set up so we can use one torch or two candles so yeah it is like that I think uh, I can use torches because we can also throw stuff at enemies and it's damaged enemies it is kind of like in <clears throat> lands of lore I think games so we can't exit from here I think we need to press this Think again, and now it opens. Yeah, let's get out of here till it closes. Mm, where the motor is, then can remove here. This is um, room, storage, and this some um, water, this water bottles. <laughs> and you might think, why do you need water? Because we have two indication water and food. <clears throat> so it is one of these games uh, where we have to feed our characters, so otherwise they will be starving and like dying for toast. Mm, yeah, um, we are not allowed to like be like sleeping a lot without making a, any progress, like uh, just uh, uh, rest coming like in, uh, about this gate. 
So I have to find some more stuff. Uh, I don't know what is that. We have to uh, click this object like we got with stick and wooden stuff it says. You can look at it. Um, uh, this wooden stuff is ancient and now it's smooth with use. It weighed one uh, kilogram. Yeah, so and if we say use apple and click here, then she will eat apple with a take arrow. So it is kind of nice. You have two girls and two guys. So uh, it is not as sexy as some other games. Like you can find 20 other games. Mm. Yeah. And now there's some. Uh, oh, there's some glitch because I thought it's some purpose thing. There's some chest, ancient chest. Let's look at it. Put this chest in the left hand of your leader to use it. Uh, uh, left hand of my leader. Um, which one is my leader? Mm -hmm. Okay, is this leader? I think the one who selected. Uh, I'm not really sure what it does, but it does something. Put this chest into left hand of your leader to use it. Okay. Uh, who is our leader? Are you our leader? <laughs> uh, the game have just begun. I already got last duck. I think we also need key for this chest. So I don't know how we got a key. I think uh, on my po po test poetry, I have seen a key. Maybe that was key for this chest. Because I haven't <coughs> decided what to do with this chest. Um, this game kind of nice. It's not like Wolfstein. And you have this uh, round things, round corners. Mm. I think key was in the next room, something like key. There also some NPC character this room, but it is no more longer NPC character. I don't know what happened to him, but I clearly remember there was some NPC character in this room. Running around, or maybe it was the next room. And it was not like very nice NPC character. He didn't want to talk with us, he was just running around then and asked to get lost. Mm. But I think there was key somewhere. And I don't know where it is key. So, the problem is these RPG games, they can be kind of obscure, and especially old RPG games. They can be very obscure. And then the gets confused. <laughs> okay, so there's some cheese. It is not getting cheesy. Mm. Uh, everyone is okay. I think this guy needs a carrot here. Eat a carrot. He got a little food matter. It is getting dark. I think the bigger the room, the darker it is. So we need more light for bigger rooms. We pressed this room and something got opened. Okay. Says go away. He does not want to speak with us. Oh. Mm, I don't know what to do, but maybe I can. Oh, I'm not sure how to fight with creatures because I'm trying to press uh, uh, How do you fight in this game? Okay. It's just, I think it is cancel, I think it is, it's held bar. Oh, one of our characters, I think, dead. Yeah. Okay. 
can get back. Uh, I think we can't use this character and uh, we got lost our its items on the ground. Uh, so the game does become and we are already on the game. I think we and this our wizard for got died. Mm, because wizard still kind of scratches, so they die first. I'm not sure what we can do now. How do we recover this person? But apparently, all his items fall on the ground. <clears throat> so I think I seen key here. Here we have this key. Okay. What is key for? Yeah, that is it. Uh, this key ceramic like stone, set it in. Okay. And then we have, have a give this key. But I have no idea how to use it. Can we put this key? I think we need manual for this gate. I really understand what is happening is it to here. I think this door got opened, but I'm not sure where we will, it will lead. Oh, it is another out this guy. Let's run away because we don't know how to fight this guy. <laughs> I think it is trying to, how do I say it? Um, but at least we know that we can throw some, uh, how do I say, torches at these guys and then they get. Okay. Let's close this door. How it closes it? I'm not sure. I think it can be only open, but it can't be closed. Okay. What does this black is say? Uh, not how lower level. Uh, I think uh, I also don't have a map. <laughs> sure, do I need what? I think I can already start drinking stuff. Oh, and we also get empty bottle. I think there is some place where we can refill our water. <laughs> but I'm not sure where. I think she also need can use some water. I think it refuse half of it. <laughs> mm, that is interesting. I think uh, you can't like poise it hard, but uh, this you can poise. Not sure, can you? This is not clickable. I'm not sure what this little poise means. Maybe you have to have clear hands or not clear hands. So only this dude has this thing. We can't press key. We can't press bottle here. So maybe. But we can't press chest here. And it's really strange. Huh? And I'm not sure if it is possible to find menu for this game. If you can, I intend, please uh, leave a link in comments or somewhere else where, like, not link, probably YouTube will block you for leaving link, but just say where you can find this menu. Okay, some other stuff, some water, and some something. What is that? A silver bracelet of simple but striking design. We can place it here. Not sure what it does. Uh, class 2 wizard, class 0 have 22 on the tree. So that guy is wizard. And this is uh, class combat 
class one, wizard class one, uh, combat class one. We, with, I think it's a uh, kind of all universal. So, is dude is uh, uh, has uh, two in combat and one in uh, wizardry. And with Goro, it can both uh, fight and cast spells. And with uh, Goro, can shall so universal. So this guy was like fighter, and he's just I don't know, they are like balanced. And this was like a uh, uh, wizard. She's carrying 24 kilograms, 25 kilograms maximum. Uh, not sure. So this switches between characters. I think is this uh, con risco is that uh, games here use the uh, middle mouse button and it actually allows me to strive. With mid uh, uh, middle mouse button I strive. But with left mouse uh, with right mouse button I like to <clears throat> okay, it is this guy, which almost killed us, not killed us, I think we were here last time. There is a lot of stuff in this hallway, let's go central hall. I don't know what this pentagrams means. Green gemstone, what it is for? This gem is called Heart and Beautiful. <coughs> Another torch. It can, can be useful for uh, and we will fire and another at this uh, ghost guys because we can only throw sticks at them and like torches. So these torches they have two purposes to kill enemies uh, like uh, to light environment what it is. I'm not sure what these pentagrams mean. Because there is also magic, but to cast magic we need to pick these runes, but I think it is seen in game menu what to do. So yeah, it is kind of complicated. <laughs> mm. If you have any idea what it means. So, right mouse button uh, uh, picks forward, left uh, backward. <laughs> yeah, I picked uh, it here, and, but it is not active. And this is uh, enemy health bar, so when we encounter enemy, it gets filled. It is. Oh, that was teleporter, so apparently we get. Oh. Oh. And that is one thing to be able to mm. So basically it is teleporters, but I'm not sure how I'm still in the same place. <laughs> apparently I am. No, that haven't opened this door, it opened some other door. <laughs> but this opened this door. And what we opened that door? It was here somewhere. Yeah, now it is open, there's some dude. Mr. Dude, you are no Christian is capable of speech, apparently it is can only be far out. Uh, I am not sure how to fight it. Enchanted for uh, our I'm not sure how to fight this creature.
Yeah, have some water. So apparently we can't draw things at it. Yeah, drawing stuff works. Uh, torches, drawing torches work best. Okay. <laughs> uh, I have no words for that. Like, okay. But we know how to do it like that. Mm, like literally. Yeah, using like inventory stuff to fight these guys. I, I should have thrown chests into them. I have no idea. Okay. Uh, so if you click this, you can actually select between life and alive. So these are these two colors. What is that? Uh, small silver coin, so apparently it has some money. But I'm not sure if uh, we have any use for them other than throwing at enemies. <coughs> at least we have no larger amount of food because it is that folks to folks, they won't need to eat it, so. <laughs> And that is another thing, so another one of them. Ah, oh, how do you fight them? Okay, so driving stuff is effective. Uh, I'm not sure if uh, there will be some other way to fight. Oh, that is the thing. Okay, I think we need to rest a bit because we got like really massacred. <laughs> mm. We also have this thing, I think it is tiredness. Sleep a bit more because mm, I think these monsters they randomly respawn, so it is kind of possible to run away to Fratia Matia Pria Propla despawn. I just think, but yeah. Also, have tiredness, so when we run full hair, we'll have to sleep. That does <coughs> think with this game kind of unusual. If you see another like dungeon crow or, or like blobber where it had such stuff, mm. uh, with tiredness mechanics, I think there were some roguelikes with uh, food but not with uh, water toast. Each one is kind of unique but you can recover most of your stuff by sleeping. I think we are done. Oh. We are getting. What is going on? Torture should be poisoned in hands of character if you wish to use them. I think we run out of working torches. Yeah, oh, sorry, that is my timer already. <coughs> so, 
Mm, that is the dungeon for Archon Archimedes. That is the early Archon game. Or not game PC, that just PC because there are not that many games as there are like different programs, some of them educational programs. Um, <clears throat> if you like these games and these other systems, I can continue reviewing them, or maybe you want me to return to less obscure like platforms like Windows. Mm. Uh, I will leave a uh, 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 hard disk image with this game and uh, emulator so you can start running a bit by yourself if you like. So, thank you for watching and let's leave this game and <laughs> uh, bye bye.